whether you are a doctor in Italy or anywhere in Europe, or you're a farmer in a remote village in India, or an IT professional in the Silicon Valley, or a social worker in Ethiopia, we all smile when we are happy, we cry when we are sad, we yawn when we are sleepy, and we jump when we are excited, don't we? I think the expression of our most intimate emotions is universal. And all of us across the world, despite our geography, our language, and our culture, are more similar than we actually acknowledge. The music forms a bridge between this abstract emotion and the spoken word. And the abstract quality of Indian classical music is what lends itself to express this subcrystalline thought very potently. And hence, I believe and everybody can enjoy Indian classical music. I know a few of you might have a doubt about what I'm saying right now, but I want you to think of the first time when you were trying to ride a bicycle. I remember when I was trying to ride a bicycle, I was completely hopeless. I was like, there's no way in this world I can ever ride a bike. Did you feel the same way? Yes. My brother was helping me uh, and I was going <laughs> and falling off and I'm looking around and it's coming so easy to everyone else. If you look at the scientific explanation, it's really simple. As long as you keep the center of gravity aligned and you keep on riding, you will find your balance. But this scientific explanation doesn't help you when you're actually trying to learn. What helps you is the instinct. You have to develop an instinct to be able to ride the bike. And I think, in a very similar way, you have to develop an instinct for Indian classical music. And if you do, I believe everybody can enjoy Indian classical music. I want to share an example. I was actually touring the northwestern part of the United States about a week ago. And I was in this town, uh, Livingston, Montana. Was about to perform. When the curtain opened, there was a mutual amusement between the audience and the artist, which was me. I'll tell you why. Because the audience was like, why is he sitting cross legged yoga style on the floor? <laughs> and I was like, why are they wearing such big cowboy hats and boots? So it was predominantly a white audience. And I knew I was up for a challenge. So I Ask them who has listened to Indian classical music before. Clearly nobody had. Then ask them another question a show of hands on who has learned or listened to jazz music. Almost all hands went up. Then I tried to draw parallels between jazz music and Indian classical music and just gave them a quick let them on what is refrain and what is improvisation. After improvisation, how do you go back to the refrain? I explained to them the scale and the meter that I was going to sing it. And within 20 minutes of my presentation, they started getting a sense or a hang of what was happening. Every time I was going back to the refrain, they would go, ah. So I think, uh, and actually at the end of it, uh, before the last piece I mentioned that in classical music, every time you do a concert, we pick different scales and meters. So I encourage you to uh, all come tomorrow for my concert. Believe me or not, about 50 to 60 percent of them came back again and it was another sold out show. So if someone that has no clue after two hours is able to enjoy and connect with Indian classical music, I believe everyone can enjoy Indian classical music. Uh, I think I want to do a little social experiment to prove this again. And uh, for that, I would love a few volunteers to sing with me. How about all of you? Yes. Does that work? Yes. Can I have a show of hands, please? Yes. Can I get a... So please know, music is a response. I don't want you to try and understand and celebrate with anything but that's what I feel. 
let's sing after me. And we'll start forming a tune and creating an instrument. Is that clear? Okay, so after me. So how many of you have performed Rag Desh on stage before? None of you? Okay. Mama, 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 mama,
Thank you so much. 